everybody! I know this is an unusual location for our lesson today, but I ran out of time and I just have to do it in the bathtub because I'm multitasking and I had to take a bath too. So, uh, please open your books to page 63 from uh, the last lesson and we are going to be talking about the mean value theorem. It has nothing to do with being mean. Now the mean value theorem says that if the function fx is continuous on a and b, and the first derivative exists on the interval a and b, then there exists a number x equals c on a and b, such that, mm-hmm, you see that? Okay, so we are going to start by writing that problem on the back of this, oops, oh, there, there, just a minute, there went my pen. of inverse trigonometric functions. All right, turn to this page in your book, please, and we are going to start... Uh-huh. We're going to start working out this problem. Now, if you see here that y equals sin x for... What does that say? <gasps> oh, didn't see now. Well, it's, it's, it really didn't damage the book. It's, it's actually perfectly usable. Yes, absolutely. Oops, where's my papers? Okay, I hope you're following along at home. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to go on to the next problem here, problem five. And where is my... Oh, oh dear. Okay. Um, you know what? I, I want you to talk amongst yourselves while I finish my bath, and next week I will be presenting the answer to those problems. Um, don't forget all your worksheets. These, these are very important here, and they have, they have all the... Uh, they have all the information on them, and, and they'll be very helpful to you. I have to get back to my bath now. So, calculus, take me away! Okay, you can stop the camera now. Stop the camera, please.